Hi, this info session is part of a wider user uptake strategy of the European Commission. One of the aims of that strategy is to stimulate the development and use of innovative downstream applications that incorporate Copernicus data and services. One of the objectives of CMEMS is to provide different levels of information dedicated to both scientific community and other users like public authorities or industrial companies. The submodule is generic and will show you CMEMS product portfolio and data access. The objectives of the module are to present you briefly the CMEMS website, to browse CMEMS online catalogue and type of product, to show how to access and download data from the CMEMS service through the online portal and to show how to visualize the downloaded product. The particular use case shown here as an example is the following. We want to download temperature data along the Greek coast for fisheries activities. Let's start with another view of the Copernicus Marine Service, which full name, CMEMS, stands for Copernicus Marine Environment Monitoring Service. The data policy is under full free and open access. As shown in the process, you can see that even without registration, you can search and browse the catalog and also discover and visualize products. Registration is necessary only when you will need to download the datasets for further uses. The registration process is quite standard. You just need to provide user details, organization details and accept the service level agreement. Time to complete the registration process is less than 10 minutes. And now you just have to look at your emails since you will receive a confirmation email containing your login and password. This quick start email will show you and provide you with useful links for beginners. Once your account is open, then logging in can be automatic. CMEMS is the one-stop shop for all the Copernicus marine data. Temperature, salinity, ocean currents, wind, sea ice, sea level, biology, chemistry, chlorophyll, and soon waves. Once we are on the CMEMS website, let's see how to search and browse the catalog. There are three ways to enter the CMEMS catalog. The first one is by parameter or keyword search. The second one consists in viewing the full catalog. And the third way is to download the full PDF catalog if it's easier for you. In all the cases, you do not need to be registered to search and browse. The first way is for me the most intuitive. You can refine your search with more parameters or using a keyword search. The second way shows you the complete catalogue organized by geographical areas, numerical models, observations and parameters. The third way allows you to download the catalogue as a PDF file. Once your product search is performed, you have a short list of products. There is one URL per product and you can access all the technical details as shown in this video. You can add up to 10 products in your cart in order to read more information later on and select the one that best fits with your needs. No need to be registered to be able to add to cart. The other interesting feature on the website are the sections on the right column of the CMEMS website. You can have access to online tutorials or the FAQ section. You have access to a collaborative forum where you can share information with the CMEMS community. And you can see the latest news such as a new product available. You can even be informed on the product improvements. After this generic information, let's get back to our use case. I've chosen to explore the catalog by parameter. So I have to build my search by area of interest, then by parameter, then by type of products, such as observations or models. Once this is done, I select the product of interest. In our case, I remind you that we want to download temperature data along the Greek coast for fishery activities. This slide show you how I visualize the product that best fit my needs. I have the product ID, I can zoom on Greece and I can also modify the color panel. These features are embedded within the CMEMS website. No need to download a specific viewer. 
You will see in this video that I can also download a PDF file of the product for my specific use. Now that I've seen the product and that I'm sure that's the one I need, I want to download it. If you do not already have an account, that's the step where you will need to register as explained previously in the presentation. Now I'm logged in and you will see how easy it is to download the product. Once I've chosen the right dataset for my product, I can tailor my geographical region of interest not to overload my computer. I can do this step directly on the map. I select as well the time range with a start and an end date and the depth that interests me. CMEMS also offers several possibilities for download, taking into account some of your subset choices in order to show you directly the size of the file you want to download. Now I have downloaded the product and I can display it on Google Earth or add it as a picture I had downloaded in my report. Thanks a lot for watching this video and I hope it helps.